Hey guys, in this video, I'll show you how to make the best crosshair. Before we do anything, the first thing you should turn off is firing and movement error. Unless you're new, you want a clean and stable crosshair. I like to set my color to green, cyan, or white because I find they stand out against most maps, with the least exceptions. Outlines I will put on for most people because a lot of the times, your eyes will focus on an enemy but you do not know where to aim because you can barely see your own crosshair. I like to get outlines to one or two but I suggest you at least have them. So there are four different crosshairs that are all great. There's the cross with no hole in the middle, the cross with the hole, the dot, and the outline dot. Now I will show you personally what works for me, and I would like you to try to make a crosshair similar to mine. I'll make all four different styles. First, we have the crosshair with the hole. I like 1422 because you can just see it really clearly, but it's precise enough to see your enemy. I tried multiple different ones, but this is the perfect balance for me. Some people like it smaller, or with no outlines, or bigger. It all depends on what you like. The ones with no gap are good as well, but I think with the gap in the middle, it's good because you can see whether your crosshair is on an enemy or not. Some people find the hole in the middle weird or distracting, and it all depends on your personal preference. Next, we have the dot crosshair. I've seen most players use outlines for this because it's just dot. A lot of players use a thickness of two, and I guess that's good with outlines too. It's a clean crosshair, and that's why so many people feel like they have a better shot at the enemy because it's clear whether the crosshair is on an enemy or not. It also blocks less of the screen than let's say the cross. The last one is basically an outline of the dot and it's actually getting more and more popular. I personally think this isn't as good because it's hard to focus on it. But anyways, just turn line length to 1 and the offset to 3 or 4. It's the best for seeing your enemy, but the worst for seeing your crosshair. I think the best crosshair is the cross with the gap or the dot with outlines. But again, it all depends on you. You have to figure out the trade-off for crosshair visibility to sight visibility. I hope this video helped and have a good day.